Hello everybody and welcome to another Jurassic World Dominion video and for today's we've got some amazing news because well there's actually a few things. First thing I want to talk about is the one that everybody knows is that Fast and Furious 9 in IMAX will be showing off a five minute clip of Jurassic World Dominion. Yes, the big news that we were expecting was here. Many people assumed this is what would happen, like they assumed it would be like probably a little teaser trailer or something for Fast 9 that you would only be able to see in theaters, but it is official what it is. And a five minute clip! And that's not all, guys, but that's the biggest news we've gotten all year for Dominion, which is awesome. I cannot wait to see what it is. I hope that they can also share it on like Colin Trevorrow's Instagram and Twitter because there's a lot of people who won't be able to see it in theaters and especially in IMAX because, well, let's just be real. It's going to be very difficult with a lot of people not being able to go to theaters with them still closed and stuff. But other than that, I, I hope they can do that. Because for me, I don't even know if I'll be able to see it because theaters here where I am are still closed due to the pandemic. Which hopefully they are open by then, but who knows? We'll have to find out. But the other news we've got for Dominion is an official image revealing a brand new dinosaur which i can't remember what it is okay guys i'm back and i figured out what it is the dinosaur in the image that is revealed is moros interpidus i believe i'm pronouncing that right if i am not i apologize my pronunciation skills are a little bit rusty i haven't gotten to say some complicated dinos in a while but not only that um in the Mitch, we also see another dinosaur there, which many people are actually asking, but Colin Trevorrow has stated that it is the Giganotosaurus, which, before you go panicking, like, what about the scene that was rumored by Sam Neill? Because, remember, we discussed that, like, ages ago. But this is, um, with Giganotosaurus and this new dinosaur, so we got more than we expected. And, of course, this Moros Interpretus is feathered, finally, which... I'm pretty sure there's also rumors that, um, I think there was something about the clip being, like, a prequel to the movie itself, which is a little strange. I don't know if that's true, but we'll find out, obviously. And if that's the case, then this could take place 65 million years ago in, I think, Argentina? I think that's where it's found, but I don't know. But, guys, we're gonna have to leave it there. That's all the news we have so far. I'll cover more if there is more. So sorry guys, we're back here again. I know, the same video and stuff, but as of starting to edit this again, there was more news posted about the um, clip. Two things that were discovered. One is that it's going to be sort of a pre a time travel clip where we're going back to 65 million years ago, where we're gonna see some dinosaurs in their time, which is very interesting. I don't know what it's gonna what importance it's gonna be and stuff. But the other news that we have to talk about is that there are seven new dinosaurs confirmed. Now, I don't know what these dinosaurs are except for the Giga and Oros Interpidus, but there could be other new ones like some that we already know of, like the Deinonychus or, well, not really Deinonychus, but remember, this is in um, dinosaur times in the Cretaceous period. So there's gonna be a lot of, um, um, South American dinosaurs, so we gotta take that into place. And there's also um, an announcement about um, the Giga, which states that there's going to be a T-Rex versus Giga fight, which I don't know if that's gonna be in the clip, but if it is, then well, maybe Rexy will also follow in that prehistoric T-Rex's footsteps and face the Giga, cause we know they're making one for Biosyn or something like that, but Either way, that's all the news, and we'll probably discuss those in their own video, but just wanted to point that out, guys. Remember to, um, if you've enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate the like, and if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button to join the hunt. Be safe, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye